Hello, I'm Kayleigh Reynolds and I'm the Learning Area Manager at the Stroud School of Art. And I want to welcome you to the Stroud School of Art virtual open event presentation. I'll do my very best to try and talk you through the slides and introduce you to what we do here. Long ago, creative careers were besmirched by the idea of the starving artist. Thankfully, the idea that there's no money in being creative has long been dispelled, but might still remain in the minds of some. In fact, one in 11 jobs is creative, and the creative industry for at least the last 10 years is the fastest growing industry in the UK, worth over £90 billion per year. The Creative Skills Toolkit taught to institutions like ours is greatly sought after by industry, far reaching the creative sector. Industries support strategists and marketeers to problem solve and to develop new ways of seeing. And the COVID lockdown helped us to reignite our passion in something crafty or creative. In fact, everything that you see and interact with has been designed by somebody with a creative education behind them. Therefore, there is money, there are jobs, and there is a future in creative practice. I have listed on the next couple of slides a long list of job titles and might be disciplines that you might have a future in. These aren't exhaustive, but they serve as umbrella titles for jobs within the industry and might be of interest. Underneath all these job titles will be starting roles, medium and higher roles. And again, this list is not exhaustive. Feel free to pause the video to have a real look at where your career might lead to. I myself have training in design, mainly fashion and graphics, but my skill set allows me to apply my knowledge of how to work through a project in various areas, wider than the two I'm trained in. This transferable skill set is what helps maintain a career within the creative industries. In fact, people nowadays label this as a portfolio career, being able to apply skills and experience to new topics and opportunities, keeping you relevant and ultimately employable. The Strauss School of Art is nestled within the Five Valleys and has been established in creative education for 160 years. We are truly proud of our heritage and it had it not been for COVID, we would have been celebrating this summer in true School of Art style. We are devoted to creative exploration and support contemporary as well as traditional practice in our curriculum, mirroring the industry in which we are training our students for. All of our tutors are practicing creatives in a wide variety of disciplines. You might not find this in institutions elsewhere, but we are very proud that we have practicing artists, designers and musicians within our department. This keeps the teaching and advice and guidance relevant to contemporary practice and industry. We are also able to call upon one another to collaborate in different events and ideas throughout the year to broaden the horizons of our cohorts. Throughout the department, which covers three floors of the campus, we hold workshops that have industry standard equipment to be able to support the learning of new and development of existing knowledge and skills. If only we were able to give you a proper tour of the studios and facilities we have, you cannot really appreciate it. However, However, just to say we have around six specialist workshops, 17 teaching spaces and two digital rooms assigned to the use of creative students. I'm very proud to be a custodian of the Stroud School of Art and to work in a space that nurtures the talent of tomorrow. All the work that you see within these slides have been created by students and opportunities that have been curated for them by our team. The soundtrack has also been created in-house by our music team and students. Here is an overview of the courses that we run within the campus. They range from level one to level five, from the lowest level requiring no experience or grades to level five, which is second year of university. We cover a broad span, as you can see, it has numerous entry points, depending on level of experience and ability. This also shows the opportunity to move from one level to another, from one subject to another, as you move through your experience with us at SGS. These stepping stones support the progression from one level to another based on the individual's wants and needs. This year, we're also offering two new courses at level four and four five. 
the Creative Enterprise course blends business and art to, to support entrepreneurial startups. And the foundation degree in design and materials continues the development of design methodology through practical and theoretical projects. If you would like to learn more about the courses, please book into one of our one-to-one -one sessions with tutors or have a look at the supportive documentation for the open event today, as well as the online perspectives. All of the courses at varying levels have set entry criteria, as you can see here. These allow us to ensure that you are going to have the best experience and the most appropriate course for you. It doesn't matter if you start low, you have the opportunity to go high as you travel with us and improve your skills, understanding and ability. Some people just need a little extra time to get there. Regardless of level, all of our courses help to introduce and develop your skills within the creative cycle. This is usually taught at three days on site with an additional day as homework or self-directed study, SDS. The cycle involves researching what already exists to understand what is possible and to be inspired. The creation and development of ideas through critical analysis of your work and others, introduction to new practical skills in sessions and workshops, and the ability to reflect upon learning, including, and importantly, learning from mistakes. Whilst learning with us, you will have the opportunity for enrichment activities, and these will be relevant to your chosen subject. In the past, before the pandemic, we visited London and all of its galleries, exhibitions and shows. We've had residentials for music at the world-renowned Rockfield Studios, and for the visual arts students, a week-long residential in a European capital. Our aim through trips like these is to broaden the horizons for all of our students, regardless of their background. Ultimately, the aim of all of our courses is to aid progression from one level to another and onto further or higher education or employment. We support this through ongoing learning, progression targets and support in portfolio development and personal statement writing. Additionally, our aim is to nurture the increase in confidence, ability to show work to an audience and to grow in the belief that you can do something that is valued to others. The successes of the School of Art helps to set us apart from other institutions offering similar sorts of courses. We support innovation in creative education and delivery and even in times like Covid we have been continuing to innovate and provide opportunities for students to grow. In normal non-Covid times we hold an exhibition at the end of every academic year where we show students work off in the gallery that we create in our art school. We line at least 13 studios and cover the hallways full of work that's been produced by students' end of year projects. And we usually have quite a healthy turnout of over a thousand visitors to view the work being exhibited. This year, with COVID, we digitised some of our art school and exhibited online instead. Throughout the year, we also have additional opportunities that enrich the students' experience in their course, including completing live projects with clients, the ability to sell and showcase their work mid-year, and if they're lucky enough, be spotlighted on our Instagram. We have been continuously graded outstanding by Ofsted for our provision and have a continuous track record of high achievement at levels one to three in the visual arts courses, with special mention of the quality of work in our game design remit. We also have a gold standard of alumni, including a gold award winner at Graduate Fashion Week, team punk band members who formed with us, and a soap style winner of Best Newcomer 2019. If you'd like to find out more about our courses, please see other presentations regarding specific subject areas or arrange for a talk with one of our tutors so they can advise you on the best course for you. Thank you.